everybody. With this project, we're going to be creating crayon scratch art. So what this means is we're going to be creating layers of crayon on our paper, and then we're going to scratch the top layer to reveal the colors below. The supplies that you'll need for this project are a piece of paper and crayons. You would definitely need a black crayon, but the other colors, you can use whatever colors you would like for that. So gather your supplies, and we'll be ready to get started. Okay, I've gathered my supplies. I've got a white piece of paper. You're probably gonna want about a half size um, sheet of paper. We're gonna be doing a lot of coloring, so if you have a full size piece of paper, it's, that's gonna be a whole lot of coloring and your hand might get kinda tired. So you might wanna um, tear or cut your paper in half so you have a smaller piece. You're gonna need crayons. You definitely need a black. Otherwise, you can do whatever colors you would like um, on your paper. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start with a color and I'm gonna make a wavy line and color that space in right here. So you don't have to do the exact same pattern. You definitely don't need to do the same colors that I'm doing. Um, you can pick what kind of pattern or the colors that you use. Um, but what we want is we wanna fill our entire paper in with crayon. Oops. So I'm gonna draw another wavy line and color that space in between the first wavy line and the second. So I'm gonna continue all the way across. Okay, I filled in my paper with my different colors and patterns. Um, now, our next step is we're gonna completely cover the entire paper with black crayon. It's gonna be a lot of coloring, so if you need to take a break at any point, then definitely do that. You don't have to sit and work on this all in one session. If you wanna, um, if your hand's kinda of tired after coloring this, just take a, a little bit of a break and work on something else and then come back to this. Um, once you're ready. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my black crayon and I'm going to cover the entire picture. Now I don't want to do it like this. That's not going to be enough. Like I have to cover the entire picture like this. So, or the entire paper. So I'm going to keep going and do get that done. Okay, I've co covered my paper with black crayon. Um, you can still see some of the color through, but I've colored it enough. So you wanna use something like a paper clip, that, um, that's what I have. You could even use, if you're, um, you know, check with a parent, maybe something like a key or a screwdriver, that would be okay too. Um, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna scratch a design into my picture. You can pick the design that you make. I'm gonna do my name and then maybe some um, things in the background. So. I'm going to use my, um, oops, my um, paper clip and you might kind of discover some things work better than others to scratch into. This one is kind of thin so you know it's taking me a little bit. I have to kind of go over but I kind of like how that looks and I'm just putting in my, I'm just doing my first name. put some designs around that. Okay, so I've scratched in a variety of different kinds of lines and shapes and designs for you to see. I did my name as well. You can even try using different materials like um, different supplies like a paper clip or a key or even a coin or something like that to try different thicknesses of what you can scratch. I hope you had a lot of fun creating this artwork and I can't wait to see everybody's creations. Bye.